Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back for another video. Today is a weekly vlog. I'm really getting into the vlogging. I'm having so much fun with it and I'm enjoying it so much. So I hope you guys like the vlogs. There will be fashion videos coming. I've just got so much on at the moment that I haven't had time to like sit down and film a fashion video, but they will be coming. I'm gonna do like a what I'm loving in my wardrobe, but I hope you're all doing really, really well. I've got this little cardigan on today that I'm obsessed with from a brand called Riojas. I'm actually gonna do a little video with them in November. So you guys will see more from this brand then, but I am obsessed with their stuff. I I actually will have a discount code in November as well, so yeah, but obsessed with this little fluffy cardigan. In today's video, we actually go to Spain for a really quick little girls trip. We had to sort a few things out in Spain while we were out there, that was kind of like the reason for the trip, but I vlogged it anyway, so I'm really excited to get into that. I hope you're all doing well, don't forget to hit subscribe, check me out on Instagram and TikTok, I'll leave all links and everything in the description box below. Before we get into today's video, I want to say a huge shout out to Casetify, thank you so much for working with me on this video. If you guys do not know, my phone case that I get quite a few questions on is a case to five case i'm obsessed with this case what i love about it is you can see the background of my phone on this case so i've honestly had this on like since the start of summer and not taken it off i am somebody that throws their phone up down left right smash it on the ground these cases are like indestructible seriously they have very kindly given me a discount code for you guys so i'm gonna pop the discount code on the screen and i'm gonna do a little bit of an unboxing with you guys because they sent over some new designs and phone cases that i think you might be obsessed let me show you them all because I am in love. Okay, so if you don't know, Case Fry actually do personalized phone cases. So this one is like a baby pink case that just says Georgia on it. I am so obsessed. I love all their phone cases. They just keep my phone really well protected and that's why I love them. Next up, I picked up this super cute phone case. So this one just has like loads of little bears all over it. I love this. I'm gonna get it out. Oh my God, it has like a teddy bear with a little jumper on. One's got sunglasses on. Can you guys see all the protection that they have on the phone case? So like here they've got like rubber bits that if you drop your phone, uh, they're just the best. And who could say no to the cutest designs? So I grabbed this one. This is like a pair of cowboy boots. I love this. What I like about this case is you can see the color of your phone in the background. I love these cowboy boots. This is like, I've just booked a trip to Nashville. I know, I cannot believe it. And this will be the phone case that I will be wearing throughout that whole trip on my phone. I just think for a mirror selfie. Everybody likes a cute phone case. I might put this one on my phone now. Actually, no, I think I'm gonna put this one on because we're approaching spooky season and this is the perfect phone case. So this is like all little ghosts and pumpkins and cats. How flipping cute is this? I'm actually gonna put this one on my phone now. Okay, and then the most satisfying part of it all. How cute is this? I'm really glad I went for this one. I just think for Halloween, it's so cute. I'm obsessed. But they do a plethora of phone cases. They do accessories, phone charms. We did also pick up a little phone charm. I'm gonna pop on my phone. I just always think these are really cute. Okay, so this is the phone charm. How beautiful. They do loads of different phone charms. It's so, so pretty. Also, they sell on Casetify the glass screen protectors. I have one on my phone right now. I always have a glass screen protector on my phone. I just don't wanna pay for a new screen. But they're also scratch resistant. They're super thin. Not 0.33 mm ultra thin. Thank you so much to Case to Fight for working with me on this little bit of the video. This is enough rambling. I can speak for England. Let's get straight into the vlog. Hey guys, welcome back to another weekly vlog. I'm like on a roll with the weekly vlogs and I'm really enjoying it. I'm actually off today to Mallorca. I'm only there for, I can't remember if I'm there for two nights or three nights. So just two nights. And I'm so, so looking forward to it. We are, I'm going with my mum and my sister. My mum needs to go out there and do something. So she said to me and my sister, do we want to join her? So we are. And it'll be a nice little girls trip. I've just put on this little outfit. I've got this blazer from Meshki. Loving Meshki. I feel like I want to do a big order from them. So obsessed. A little white vest top. And then I've got these jeans on these are like my new favorite jeans they're from a brand called loval i did an ad with them over on instagram and i do have a discount code i have not stopped wearing these jeans they're like my favorite ones at the minute so i'll leave them linked below if you're interested just packing my sunglasses and i need to leave because i'm actually really really late so i'm gonna get my suitcase together and my bags and let's go i'm so excited hello vlog so we've made it to me my blusher that i put on this morning i used the benetton and i do think it's a really good blusher but i obviously didn't blend it i obviously just put like a splodge on my cheek because i can literally see where i've painted the blusher on my face anyway i'm stuck in my jacket <laughs> vanessa's stuck in a jacket here's vanessa hi say hi everyone i did the button up right and now i can't get out Ding. oh done it here's olivia we're off to dinner. Yeah. We literally got here like, what, 20, 20 minutes, minutes ago? Yeah. yeah. We're staying in the, shoot, me, uh, Vanessa is going to say it correctly. The Gran Melia de Mar. De Mar, yes. Ilietas. And it's really, really nice. Yeah. Really nice. We're off to grab some quick dinner and then I'll update you guys when we get back to the room. But I just wanted to come and say hey. Okay, guys. So we've just come to a little restaurant literally across from where the hotel is. And I just thought I'd show you my dinner because it looks so, so nice. I've gone for the salmon. These two healthy queens have gone for a goat cheese, goat cheese salad. Goat cheese salad. But we did 
have Dad's Bravas and a whole loaf of bread, so. <laughs> Hi, so we have just got back from dinner. We literally had dinner across the road. Um, We literally, I feel like I'm on like a vlog roll at the minute. Like I filmed a random October weekly vlog the other day. I'm filming a house tour at the minute. Oh, that's like a that's like a ring light oh that's a bit much i've got so much happening with the house which is so exciting so excited to get home because we've had like the carpet cleaned in the living room and we've had all the painting done and it's all happening while i'm away so really excited to get home and see all that but this is like a random little short break that i'm taking with my mum and my sister we are here in mallorca please ex excuse the state of me just for two nights so we're here for tonight and tomorrow night my mum's just had, sorting something out out here and she asked me and my sister if we wanted to join her and we decided that we really wanted to do like a girl trip i love these little girls trips we did one to barcelona at the beginning of the year um was it the beginning of this year or was it last year actually we did a trip to barcelona at the beginning of 2023 and it was so much fun and then at the beginning of this year we did a little trip to dubai us three as well so i love these girls trips my poor dad that stays at home while we all go and have like a cute little trip but this is just two nights and i do not actually have a bath in my house i think most of you guys know that now there is a bath in this hotel so my sister's currently in the shower and then i'm gonna hop in the bath and i could not be more excited like i've literally got my laptop ready to watch a program cannot wait should i show you guys around this room quickly okay so super quick room tour you come in and there's kind of like this little hallway this is a bar uh door to the toilet and this is a door to the bathroom so i'll show you guys that when i have my bath um oh my god i've literally just undone my jeans because i've just eaten and i'm just over it this is like where all the wardrobe space is huge wardrobe space big old mirror and then the bed's like kind of central in the middle of the room so this is our bed i cannot wait to get in that i'm like get me that nice cold glass of water and in that bed they very kindly i don't know why but they gave us a glass of um bubbles which i thought was so sweet my mum comes here quite a lot i've actually never stayed at this hotel but my mum is like she like knows the people that work here so i feel like maybe that's why and this really cute little fruit pot moment i love my new necklace by the way i just got this from olivia sales i just bought this the other day and it's like i wish i'd got maybe like gnl or like g and i don't know i wish i'd got I feel like i shouldn't have got my own initials i don't know why i feel like that um and then this is the outside which i cannot really show you because it's so dark but there's an amazing amazing sea view out there and some beds and everything so i will show you guys that tomorrow when we wake up bright and early but yeah it's really nice to be here i obviously go to dubai in november which is a trip that leon and i have had planned i think we had it planned i think leon booked that in june i want to say he booked that trip he is like treating me to that trip i don't know why i have I'm telling you guys this, but I just am. He like treated me to that trip. He literally was like, hi, like, well, he wasn't like, hi, but he was like, I booked this trip. I really want obviously us to go. And he's like paying for the whole thing and like treating me to this trip to Dubai. I'm like feeling completely spoiled. He's like booked things when we're out there. I'm so, so excited. So we've had that planned for ages and I'm so excited. And that is gonna be like our little Christmas trip. We are no longer going. We normally go obviously to Florida for New Year. As of now, we're not going there. The flights are really expensive. Maybe if I find a good deal on a flight, I might end up booking it, but who knows at the minute we're not so that's gonna be our little christmas trip and i'm so so excited to bring you guys along i was gonna ask on instagram if you guys wanted a vlog but maybe i'll ask here do you guys want me to vlog dubai would you rather i didn't i know with the world at the moment and everything that's happening i feel like I, I have to obviously be considerate of that on my social platforms and i think some people want to see everything that you do and they like to just watch vlogs kind of like me watch everything that someone does and like just watch them as like a comfort video and they just enjoy the content and then i think you have other people that are you know they don't want to see certain things when certain things are happening and they feel a certain type of way and i totally appreciate that so i just i always kind of want to gauge your vibe i always i tend to do like a little poll sometimes on instagram like do you want to see me vlog this would you rather i didn't if if you guys don't want it that's absolutely fine i will go and have like a week off in dubai and not vlog a thing and just like not photograph a thing and just like enjoy the week but if you guys want to see it i'm more than happy to vlog that trip as well just let me know i'm gonna go and have a bath and i'm gonna go to bed but thank you guys so much for joining me so far i will bring you all along tomorrow and we can see what we get up to i can find myself rambling in these weekly vlogs i apologize if you can't stand it so this is the bathroom this is the big old mirror and then i'm literally running myself a big old bath it looks so good there's a little mirror there and then there's the shower which looks really nice as well loo is in there bathroom space is incredible in here so if you are someone that likes to do their makeup in the bathroom or like spend a lot of time in the bathroom you will enjoy this hotel <laughs> guys so i just seem to be just showing you food i'm not actually showing yeah, you anything exactly. we've actually been up to today but we've come and had come and had come and grabbed some lunch we've all got a large aperol and i've gone for a toasted cheese sandwich i really 
do love a toasted cheese. I feel like I put a bit of mascara on this morning and it's like run all down my face. So yeah, here we all are. Liv's gone for a very healthy yes. cookie girl. Us not so much. No. Hey y'all! Liz in a dressing gown. I look like I'm in a dressing gown, but I'm not matching my outfit for the night. Also, these slippers have got oh. GM on them, because we're staying at a hotel that obviously the initials are GM. I'm gonna have to steal these slippers. Anyway, Liv's about to open the bottle of Carver that we got, so I thought we'd film it. Oh, we kind of backlit, which is a oh, shame. I... Here, here, go like here. <gasps> you... Oh no, it's gonna fly! It's a fire. <laughs> so we've been filming for 20 minutes. <laughs> We're really odd. Like, I don't think this is normal to behave this way. Anyway, we got this lovely carver, yeah, so we're having it on the. Might not be that warm though, because. Warm? It's you only, cold? Uh, cold, because it's only been in the ice. It's honestly, been minutes. chilled for about two seconds. But oh, well. I don't think I showed you guys the view. This is the view from the room. There's my little sparkling carver. How? This is what we're saying. How? This is a gorgeous view, isn't it? Do you know what? I will have a cube of ice. I know that's a cardinal sin for yeah. a lot of people. <gasps> no! No! <laughs> Cheers! Nice and chilled. Nice and chilled. <laughs> okay, just thought I'd show you guys really quickly my outfit here. These sandals on, this skirt, this top. The lighting in here is really, really over, like, downlit. Is that it? When it's, like, above your head? Anyway, we're going to Palma. So, I will bring you guys with me. Hi, vlog. We are in Palma. We actually just popped into Zara. You can hear that lovely music. We both bought something, didn't we? We bought matching clothes. We bought matching coats. One in a black and one in a beige. And now we are going to have a little peruse in the beautiful... Massimo Dutti. Hello guys, this is like the perfect bathroom to do a little makeup video or like, you know that like um, Vogue beauty yeah. secret? It's like this is the Vogue beauty secret bathroom, I'm sorry. Shut that door, remove those trousers, get rid of the dressing gown. We're in the same bathroom. I just bought this little jacket yesterday from Zara and I'm so obsessed with it. I think it's really, really cute. I also picked up a little coat there. So if we've got time later, I will show you what I grabbed. But we're actually really needing to go for breakfast. It's nearly 10 o'clock we definitely slept in but Liv and I went to bed quite late and also we have had just like a hectic couple of days here I apologize for not vlogging more I've had quite a lot going on and lots of exciting things that I'm sure I'll be able to say at one stage on here but yeah it's been really really fun we obviously today is our last day here so we're just gonna run down to breakfast and then we've got a few like errands to do before we leave we've stayed by the way for anyone who is wondering at the gran melia de mar in ilietas but this hotel is so nice but if you come like out of season like we have you can get like a few good deals on it so sorry i'm trying to like, do this really quickly and talk at the same time and i'm terrible at multitasking so yeah it's been really really lovely if you want any more info on the hotel literally just message me on insta and we can chat about hotels i've literally just put on by the way today uh hmb concealer and a tiny bit of bobby brown skin tint i love bobby brown skin tint it's like it's all i'm wearing i'm not wearing foundation anymore i feel like i need a good foundation recommendation because i've just stopped wearing it completely i'm just wearing this skin tint i thought i would just show you guys my traveling home outfit i've got these jeans on that i love from Lovell. This little crop is from Zara. And then my little jacket, which I love as well. I bought another coat from Zara. It is so nice. It's like a little poncho cape coat. Got it obviously out here in Mallorca, so probably a lot better price point here. But that's it. There's the code. I don't know if you guys can scan that. Anyway, we're going to breakfast. We're all going to be late. I'm just about to leave and I really wanted to just like show you guys the final view because it's so lovely. Even though it is obviously cold here, it's not like summer weather. It's really, really nice temperature. We're actually off to the airport. It was a really quick trip, really exciting one. And we are now heading to the airport to fly home. We leave at eight o'clock. So yeah, just popped on this little t-shirt that I got from, I think I keep wanting to say this Brandy Melville, but I don't really go in Brandy Melville. So did I get this there? No, this is from Pakistan in America. And then my jeans and I just got my trainers on and I'm gonna chuck on my cardigan. My camera just cut out. I don't even know what we just recorded. We're on, I don't know what we just recorded, but we're on our way to Gymshark again. Well, but I am nervous workout. because I feel like Gymshark has some like athletes and I am not a Gymshark athlete. Let's just put that in bold. Hey okay, guys, we are the first people here. I feel like I'm more nervous than I was before I arrived. And um, we've got like little outfits to change into. I am actually in uh, Gymshark. I love this set so much, but they said they've got some new stuff. So I think we're gonna go for the new bits and bobs, but I do like these. I don't know, should we get a picture of these as well? Yeah. Cause they kind of match. Hello guys. So. I obviously had the bar class that I was like vlogging before I got there and then me and Liv got there and it was so hectic and crazy and the most intense class that I didn't 
have a second to even pick up my camera. I did manage to get some like uh, videos on my Instagram. So I'll pop those videos here. Make sure you follow me on Instagram because I tend to like post a lot more in the moment over there. I managed to get a few clips, but it was amazing. But those classes are so intense. I've always thought reform of Pilates was quite an intense class. That has nothing on bar classes. If you are somebody that does bar regularly, wow, because I was struggling so much. But it was a really good class. The girls were so lovely. They gave us some flowers to take away and some nice jewelry. So I'll show you guys that a uh, little goodie bag probably tomorrow because I'm off to go and see the Taylor Swift Eras tour in the cinema tonight with some of my friends. I've literally got like 15, 20 minutes to get there so I need to go, go, go. But I'm so excited. I'm a huge Taylor Swift fan. I've loved her for so long. And the girls I'm actually going to see this Eras tour in cinema with, we went to see Taylor on her Fearless tour when I was like 11. So really, really excited. Um, I don't know if I can film though. So I might have to leave you guys here. We'll see. We'll see if I can film. Hi guys. So I went to the Taylor Swift Eras tour in cinema last night and I didn't vlog. I was filming on my phone. I might put some clips on the screen now of what I managed to get in the cinema. I don't know if I'll get in trouble, but if they're muted, I think I can put them on the screen. She's an icon. I'm obsessed with her. I feel like me and Taylor, we go way back. I am one of those annoying people that is like, I've been a fan of Taylor Swift for ages. It's annoying, isn't it? But I really have. I mean, she's what got me into country music. I'm sure most of you know by now. I'm like country music obsessed. If you've not ever listened to country music, try it out and see if you like it. They tell a story in country music and that's what I love about it. And that's why I resonate with Taylor's music so much because she tells stories in her music. If you're a Swifty, you're gonna get this. But yeah, I went to see her on her Fearless tour. Me and my friend last night were trying to work out how long ago that was. We were, someone said it was 16 years ago and I was like, it can't possibly be. It, it, I will not allow it to be that long ago. So I don't know if it was like 15 or 16 years ago that we saw her at Wembley. And it was, look, I've put a bloody nose contour on today and it looks crazy. And it was just incredible. And it was like the best night of our lives. And we were so young and we have such amazing memories of Taylor. So we were not able, sadly, to get tickets for her era's tour. I tried super hard to get tickets and I just couldn't. Um, we're literally devastated about it, but I have faith that we're gonna get tickets. I'm like, we just might have to spend a little bit more money on obviously the resale market and get tickets closer to the time. So who knows what's gonna happen with that, but we had to go and see the Eras tour in cinema and it was so cute. There were like all these little girls with like sparkly outfits on with their mums and dads. It's obviously half term, so it was just so cute. We sat there for over three hours, ate popcorn, drank Coke and danced and sung our little hearts out and we just had the best time and it, it made me feel like I was 15 years old again, um, which is funny because I said to my friend last night and she said to me, how are we singing these songs when we were like 14? Like, yeah, like, you know, like all these like really intense songs. We did not have any emotional hardship at that point in our life. Don't get me wrong, later on it came, but at that point it was not there. So, oh, it was such a fab night. Um, yesterday was super hectic, but I did go to the Gymshark event and I wanted to show you guys some of the bits that Gymshark actually gifted us in the bags. Hang on. Guys, look what they gifted us. They gave us, not the bars and the water, but they gave us some hydrangeas yesterday at the event. These are hydrangeas, aren't they? They are so gorgeous. I'm obsessed with these flowers so much. This is like one of my favorite style of flowers. I just think they look so strikingly gorgeous. So yeah, they kind of gave us some flowers, which was the nicest little treat when we came out of the event. Oh my God, if you do bar classes, huge respect to you like you are a warrior it was really hard but we had a really good time nonetheless i am obsessed with gymshark i feel like i've loved the brand for ages but the longer my phone is ringing then i started wearing it again this year they reached out because they saw that i was buying stuff and wearing their stuff and we formed a relationship since i formed the relationship with gymshark i feel like my love for them has like gone tenfold as well which is really nice because you don't want to work with a brand and like that relationship doesn't continue to like grow if you know what i mean you kind of fall out of love with the brand that's never good but they gifted us some stuff and it's just we had the best time firstly they, they're now doing which i didn't know they were doing these little bags that are really handy if like me you bring out with you like your keys wallet phone and like you just want to grab something and go like you can do this like cross body you can do it on your shoulder there's like other ways you could wear this so i feel like this is kind of handy they said they gave me the purple one some little grippy socks which i've wanted for so long i do reform a pilates and i've never had grippy socks so i'm actually gonna place an order and grab some more of them i didn't know they did them on gymshark of course a little brazilian bum bum spray which i cannot stop spraying moisturizer from brazilian bum bum we then got something from this brand which is really exciting called hey harper cute oh i love this it's like a really fine 
little thin chain necklace but they do loads of bits um should i put this on now let's put this on now but these i think are meant to be like scratch resistant water resistant and hayley bieber was photographed wearing some of their stuff oh how pretty is that then we got like other pairs of leggings and gym sets and i got this wrap top that i love i already own one of these but i wear it all the time so to have another one is great because while that one's in the wash i can wear this one i'm a huge fan of the brand and feel very grateful for everything they chose to send across to me they actually gave us as well a little fleece at the end of the class I've never had one of these from Gymshark. So yeah, had the best time. Best time at the Eras Cinema thing. And I'm just feeling really good at the minute. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and vlog. Please feel free to comment below what you want to see from me uh, going into the Christmas period. I'm going to be getting my Christmas decks out very soon and transforming my whole like house. So I don't know if that's content that you guys would want or I don't know. Let me know so that I can do something that you guys would actually be interested in. Thank you so much for watching as always. I hope you have a fabulous week and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.